Konnichiwa Minasan, Watashi no Amaiwa Yega desu, and welcome back to the front. In the last episode, we did a few things, um, focusing primarily on the front lines, trying to reorganize and trying to push when our forces have encountered an enemy. We actually, this particular Mount Fuji has been getting very busy lately. <laughs> I hope that's Mount Fuji. Uh, but no, Mount Fuji has been seeing a lot of action around its surface, as our forces have been engaging Nasu and Aura forces alike, primarily, I think, around the Nasu region. And we have been fighting off many foes, attempting to punch a hole through their front lines and grab and head to the town of Thagami, uh, which is located to the 12 o'clock here. So these bastards are effectively trying to hold the line. Our great guard cavalry, our great bow guard cavalry, is now making its move to the right flank, supported by two katana cav, though they are both tired. The fighting has been pretty skirmishy, mostly. Um... But we're winning the skirmish fight, just about. Um, my infantry on the front line are suffering as a result, which is not good. Oh, I hello. I think they are probably about to commit. Yeah, here they go, here they go. Right, let's try and see if we can get these fuckers. This may come to a point where I may end up having to be all shrinky. Oh boy. Right. Reform back to normal lines. And contain to about there-ish. And then you, 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 and you. Move up to reinforce this bulk. Because I think we're going to need it. You boys. Redistribute your forces to adequately deal with the shit that will be coming this way. It's going to be on. It's going to be on, so... Right, you boys are taking cover. You boys are over there. You guys are in the shit. Pull back, pull back. Fucking boat. Right, well, they're going to lose those dudes. Dude, get the fuck over there. Come on. Withdraw. Okay, that's not really where I wanted you to stand. Fucking hell. You better start fucking routing those dudes any second now, boys. Move back here, go. Go. You, deal with that. You, over there. And you. About face. Move.
Withdraw. Get the fuck out of there, you idiot. Fuck it. Okay, those guys are doing over there. Those pricks. You, you, you. Commit. Get the fuck out of there, you fucking retard. Right, you know what? Fuck it. Everyone except General commit to melee. Kill those cunting samurai. Get the fuck out of there, you idiot. Right, you boys. Go over there, engage. You boys, go over there, engage. You, 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 and you. Concentrate fire on that bash. Bastard Ashigaru. Right, the rest of you boys. Commit on those douchebags and finish them. Left side, you will form up. You two, move over there now. Right. How long does it take? Or why are you failing to defeat against a fucking band of Nashigaru? Jesus Christ. Right. Right. You boys have been killing them. Good job. Right. Focus on those fucking pricks over there. Actually, no. Turn around. Focus on those pricks over there. Uh, Wavering. Bows. Focus your attention on them. You, focus your attention on them. You, stand and fight. Right, their main army has withdrawn. Good. Right, about fucking time. About face and rape that force. Archers. Cease fire. You boys, shoot. You boys, shoot. God damn it. No, I wouldn't call this a victory. A fucking destruction, a disaster is more the appropriate term here. shooting. No shooting. We have to kill as many of these fucking pricks as possible. Okay. <sighs> what, a, what a difference a few minutes takes. The battle ended a lot fucking sooner than I anticipated, and it ended in a not a very good way. Like, we've won, sure, but we've lost almost the entirety of the fucking army that we had with us. All I can say is praise the god em- well, thank the gods I was able to, um... Yeah, that is not a victory. I'd almost rate that as a fucking Pyrrhic victory because we, while well, defeated them, yes, a lot of them got away, and more it wor and worse still, they did way too much fucking damage to my army. <sighs> yeah, we lost a fucking samurai unit. We lost two thousand out of our fucking, like sure they lost over six thousand, but we lost units, and that is unacceptable. Are no fucking acceptable. I want to see at least most of those fucking dudes dead. No, that's fucking pitiful. Come on, guys. Fucking hell. That's just fucking pitiful. 
Ah, it's just a fucking disgrace. Okay. We gotta try and finish these wankers off. Right, these boys can't do anything. You boys regroup with these guys. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, replace a couple of the key show. Well, replace one of the key show with um, matchlock just so we've got something. Right, these boys go out. Rip into those pricks. Yeah, that'll do. I don't mind taking an uh, auto resolve in this one because I can replace the troops easily. 605, that's probably less than what I'd suffered. And they're dead. And almost all the other armies in this vicinity are now dead. 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 And dead. Okay. Good fucking job, boys. Good fucking job. Right, you boys get the fuck out. You boys get in. Get some replenishment. You deserve it. You guys deserve more than fucking replenishment. You deserve fucking pat on the pat. Pat on the back. Right. Okay. Well, we'll let these guys rejuvenate because I don't really want to waste manpower trying to fix this shit. But yeah. It's a bit shit right now. Morale I'm not feeling great on. But, you know, well, we're here. We'll have to deal with it. The important thing is that we have finally broken the back of the enemy counteroffensive and as such have destroyed a significant portion of Nasu forces. So now the road is clear to grab Sagami. Of course the enemy are already in the process of trying to close up the gap, but it is what it is, isn't it? More importantly, we do have the opportunity to launch a counteroffensive. Um... Could I attack him? No. None of us can attack him. We have to deal with an army outside the settlement. Oh, fuck me. And that's a fortress as well. If it's what- if that's- if that fucking fortress is the one I'm thinking of, I'm fucking auto-resolving. Same goes for this one. Actually, that's just a fort. And we'll have reinforcements coming in. I could commit Ogata, but I don't want to. Not yet. Or Gata. And you need to take care of that fucking Mits uh, Mitsuke. Yeah. Our first foray into Kozuke and we need to be careful. Badly. We need to be super fucking careful. Okay, let's make a push. Let's make a push onto Tokiharu. Let's 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 have Tokiharu attack. We outnumber them by quite some margin. Yeah. We have cannon, we have mortars, we have Raketenwerfer, we have quite a lot. The enemy will have reinforcements and it will be a pretty bitter struggle, but I think we should be able to launch. Okay. Takasaki. 15 fucking 70. Jesus Christ, with 30 years to go. Oh boy. <laughs> Not a lot of years, I'll be honest with you. At the rate that we've been going, we've been going since about 1545. We're about halfway there. Oh, living on a prayer. Or well, roughly halfway there. Okay, we've seen this kind of castle before. Oh. Fuck you. I know exactly what's going to happen. Uh. So now the question is... Yeah, this is the game effectively fucking me at this point. Right. Which way is north? Is it this way? In which case, we don't want to be here. God damn it, I don't know. On the one hand, I want to spawn right next to us in terms of reinforcements, but that will probably be where the fuckers are going to spawn. Unless I spawn over here, but then again, we'll still have the problem if they spawn over here. Generally speaking, I'm in a very bad situation right now. The map design is really poor at this point. Because the because at this point, we've got reinforcements here. Okay, so if we were here, and both the reinforcements are here, I think the enemy would come from around here. So I want to deploy my army 
around here. Now this of course means could be complete bollocks because the enemy will still deploy and do whatever. And I might still lose my guns. So really I'm not going to deploy them. I am instead going to deploy a giant fucking security net around them. And we'll relocate them as much as we can until we can get the fuck out of dodge with them. But yeah, it's, it's bollocks in my opinion. We are in a very bad situation right now. We're going to kind of gather up our troops as much as we can and then attempt to redeploy as fast as possible in case the fuckers are right next to us. But where are they coming from? They did come from the other side. Thank the fucking Emperor. Okay, that's honestly the best fucking news I've seen all day. Right, get the fuck over there, boys. Let's go. Everybody else, move over there now. Double fucking time it. Go. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. That is genuinely the best fucking news I have seen all day. Right, you boys, regroup over to the right flank, go. Everyone else, get fucking moving. We'll try and make the assault from this position, but holy shit. This is genuinely terrifying to me now. Oh, what's the point? The enemy are going to have fucking shots on us. If they deploy any archers to the fucking walls, which they're doing. Fuck it. Do not approach those walls. General, withdraw back to the line. Fuckers are going to try and do it. Right. Shit. Oh, the terrain makes it interesting. Thank the gods they will have to deploy their troops in a weird way. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. We can deal with it, we can deal with it. I'll have to redeploy my entire army, but at least we can redeploy it in knowing that where the enemy is coming from. Okay, you deploy the guns here. That's all we can really do right now. Um, okay. Okay, 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 okay. We need to nuke this sector badly. And these boys need to regroup. We'll rendezvous and try and see if we can do it, but yeah. We'll need to nuke this part of the wall. Once the gun gets set up, we can try and do that. Okay, you set up. Right, yeah, you boys set up accordingly. Just so we can defend the guns. Right, you boys set up over here. You boys set up the bows along here. Matchlocks will set up accordingly behind the lines, but we'll, re we'll redeploy them if and when we need to. You boys regroup to the left side and just set up accordingly. I'm going to try and fuck this wall section a bit. Normally I'd be skipping the uh, the segment and basically fighting like whatever, but because we've got another army in tow, this is actually something which is completely new to us. For the first time in quite a while, we'll be having to fight an army outside and inside a fortress as well. So we'll be in a very interesting predicament to say the least. Right, Cannon. Time to earn your keep. And hopefully you won't deploy all fucked like. Come on, come on, come on. Don't fuck the gun, don't fuck the gun. I don't mind if all of the guns can't fire, but I will mind if one of the guns decide not to turn around properly. Cannon, the, the Komo Taiho are so unreliable, it's not even funny. Like, if you, if you tell them not to fire at will whilst they're setting up, the gun just immediately won't deploy, and it will be a real pain in the ass to set up accordingly. So we have to wait for them to be set up, and then I tell them not to shoot. There we go. So we're safe. 
Alright, we'll have to reorganize these dudes a little bit, but right now we can at least prepare. Okay. Right. Okay, okay. We're gonna have to base- I'm gonna have to, like, group these into different segments, which is not exactly a problem for me, per se. And I know that in loads of other YouTubers who do these games will do the natural grouping thing. Like, they'll actually use the group button, but I really despise that. I, d I don't know why. I tried using it. Believe you me, I tried. I, honest to God, tried. To do to use it, but it just doesn't fucking work for me. It really doesn't. Okay, commander of these dudes, chill over here. The these dudes will form up behind. I want the swords in infantry to watch also. Bows, I want you guys in reserve, not to shoot under any circumstances. And you boys will chill at the front. Commander will be chilling not to the front but to the side. And I want the I want the match locks to be in a sort of a semi defensible position here. <sighs> oh yes, and you can also deploy right in front of them. Give them moral support because you know nothing sounds nothing to a man is more important than seeing when his missus is looking at him doing his job. Okay, cannon. Your job will be to fuck that wall. So fuck that wall. Luckily for us, because it's a fort, it is instant destruction. And we can start fucking over their archer core. To be fair, I don't know how many archers they've got. They must have a few. Katana. Katana. Ooh. If we can kill enough of their archers, we might be able to do the royal fucking. Like we like, that we normally do in other battles. This could be useful. Right, I have an idea. If we can do this quickly, we can potentially scrub a lot of their forces without doing without the worry. We're going to have to play careful, though. I might even be tempted to do this preemptively as well. Like, even as we make a push. We're going to lose troops doing this, but I think this is... The, the gamble I'm going to throw here is that if we can do this, we can potentially kill a lot of their dudes very quickly. This is risky, though, because we will also potentially put our troops in very perilous danger, which is why I'm going to back you guys up with spears. The, game, the aim of this game is that we're going to try and fuck over their archers as much as humanly possible. Just hit those fucking archers. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Cannons do me proud. Come on, cannon, do me proud. Can I ask what the fuck just happened? <laughs> oh, fuck me. Hit that wall, hit that wall. Cannon, do your thing. Okay, that's a large chunk of them gone. Good, keep shooting, keep shooting. Rapid fire, go. That's gone. Good, 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 good. Focus on the gate, focus on the gate. Archers are going to come up. They're going to get shat upon royally. But our aim is to try and snipe as much of their troops as possible. And we do have the ranged advantage. Hit that fort wall. Hit that fort wall. Don't give me that bollocks. No, no, no. Don't give me that fucking bollocks. You can hit that target. You've just shot the targets to the left of it. So what's the wrong with you hitting that fucking target over there? Useless sods. I'm telling you to shoot something further to the left, and yet you can tell me you can hit that. But you can't hit a fucking gatehouse. Aim for that archery tower. Has the game crashed? The game has crashed. Well, fuck me. And we're finally back. So, after attempting this battle once again for the third time, and finally having remembered to fucking save, we're here. Um, so, yes. The reason why I suddenly made a weird cut is because at the moment, whenever I try and attempt the battle of Kozuke, 
Um, the game just ups and crashes, and for the last two times, uh, on separate days and occasions, I have forgotten to save. Um, so unfortunately, the really good result that we had previously has disappeared, and we've now got a really poor result. Um, our troops have taken quite a significant amount of casualties, but it's okay because we have annihilated the same level of enemies as before, just with less um, precision and carefulness. Um, I'm at that point also was out of initiative and willpower to deal with these sieges. So I'm like, nope, I don't want to deal with them. I don't want to think about them. I just want to fucking not do anything. I just want to take care of shit and move on. So what we're going to do now for the time being is we're just going to basically go grab, um, go grab the, uh, like regroup with our troops, see what we got. Recruit some more troops. I can, I can do that. Um, and then we'll make a push towards Sagami. I'm gonna regroup my troops from here and on the western front. We're gonna hold the line a bit. Nishikambara and Kozuke can hold themselves for a bit. I don't really want to commit too much now, um, and we're just gonna sort of see what happens. Um, oh my god, it was fucking irritating. Ugh. <laughs> oh. Like, I don't know why, but it's just, for some reason, I have no fucking willpower to do this shit anymore. Okay, good. That's slightly better news. That is not as good news as I want, because now see you're coming back. But then again, they may decide to just, you know, yeah, they stay there, so I can use another army to attack. That is completely fine. Please don't crash. Emperor, thank you. Oh, God. No, no shit. Right, Kai. Ah, Kai is pissed. Bribe any army. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, you want this, don't you? Right, question. Um, there we go. We'll stop taxing you for a small period of time. And you want me to bribe an army. <laughs> well, Sunny Jim, I think I know what I'm bribing. Um... Hello, 91%. Would you like to join the Chosokabe? 91 fucking percent. Kuwana Namochi, you are a fucking trash bag. 52%, rookie noob. Come on, say yes. Oh, is that someone accepting a bribe? A fucking rookie. Imura Muchi Fusa has beaten the living fuck out of you. You waste of space. You should hand over that bandana to him. Because he's just fucking saved your ass. Jesus Christ. Ooh. <laughs> I'm just like... Why you do this to me? <laughs> oh my god. Anyway. Um, are you going to be... Um... Yeah, we need to knock out that ninja. Oh, ninja? The, yes, the ninja. We have to knock out the ninja. Not the... the oh. Problem is, you got priests all over the place. They're coming in for a big attack. I'm going to pull my ninja back a little bit, just so he can prepare for shit. Alright, who's more likely to do job? Well, Okay, you have an 84% chance of killing her. You have a 50% chance of conversion, so you will go first. I don't mind wasting a ninja to assassinate a geisha. Standard rules. You failed. Of course you failed, even though you have a higher chance. Will the same shit happen before? Oh! The priest does it. Thank you, my dearie. Welcome, Mura. It's a shame that they don't join your cause when you convert them, but it's okay. Um, anywho. Oh. Looks like the daimyo is bringing it. Right, you boys make your way across. You're going to be in the reinforcements. You're going to be right behind him. And you are going to hold the bridge. Yeah, you are going to hold the bridge. Right, okay, so reinforcements should all be capable of it. There, so that's fine. Western front is plugged. We're all good. Um... Yeah, I have no enthusiasm for this, though we're all stuffed. Unless... Yes, the army inside is quite large. Okay. 
Okide. Okide. Right. My plan is sort of still in motion, um, but it's very much reduced now in terms of like what we need to do. But okay. But the good news is also we have some new dudes. Uh, mainly in the form of this cavalry, which is pretty good. I mean, they're nuts, um, but they're pretty good. We also have oh. Oh. What? Oh. I was gonna say, I'm like, what the fuck? Uh, right. Repair you. Church? No. Uh. You technically do border certain provinces, but you're already Christian. I might as well put a chapel here. Um, oh, the daimyo and the son and heir. Which means I can't bribe the army. Motherfucker. Wait, hang on. That's a point, yeah. Might as well assassinate the daimyo. Oh, but then if I assassinate the daimyo, then the son and heir becomes a daimyo. You fucked it. Except if I target the daimyo first. <laughs> Motherfucker loses his son before he loses his own life. Ah. <laughs> and we're just gonna yeah just do that fair enough all right so the priests are gonna come down they're possibly gonna attack but i think we'll be okay touch wood and yeah no i'm i am absolutely quite satisfied with those results anywho we will need to think about making some new um question how are my fleets doing we're all good i'd say yeah i know i'd say we're all good um, agents. Do you have any special agents? Nope, they're all on the front. And armies are also all on the front. Um, Santo could be used to make troops, but I think given the fact that that's on the other side of the country right about now, we're just going to have to manage with what we've got. I mean, we've got a fairly substantial uh, force anyway, so if, if I can just deploy... Yeah, I'll deploy all of these dudes inside. They get replenishment. Um, same goes for these dudes. They can get themselves replenished. Uh, who had the cavalry? Uh, you did. Right, so you get... Alright, well we can pop the two of them in the same point. We might as well. Uh, then you get to over there. Then you also get another one of them. Okay, so you're quite strong on the cavalry front here. Um, you're like sort of okay for the time being, but I will give you you, you, and... Oh! And them. Okay, go. We'll need more troops, obviously, but I think we can... No, I said no more troops. We, we, we have troops. We can... can we can use, we can make a scratch company army on the eastern front. I don't mind too much. As long as we can grab Sagami. Once we've grabbed Sagami, we can start training more troops uh, to basically flood into this particular region. But, at the same time, it is just about getting ourselves set. But we're all looking fairly good for that. Um, but yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold position. These fuckers are going to just... Yeah, these guys are not in any danger at this moment. It's spring. We've got plenty of time. These boys are going to move up and set themselves. Uh, I'm tempted to move... Oh wait, why are we moving our troops back here? Uh, there's something... There was an agent, wasn't there? But did I take care of them? I'm fairly certain I took care of him. Um, what have we got in terms of here? Fuck loads of them. Ah, okay. Um, assassinate. I'd like to get rid of the Metsuke. They're all low chances. Um, you know, I'm going to move back over to the supply network. Get the priest. To convert the Metsuke. Would you like to... Oh. Well, shit. Uh, bollocks. Okay. I I really hate that. If there's one thing I will say, I, I think my biggest complaint of the entire Shogun 2 is it has this really bad habit of saying, yeah, you can make that, and then... At the last second, it withdraws its um, it withdraws its place and goes, actually, no, you can't. 
Um, 58% chance. I have a decent chance of converting the settlement. Oh, I, I kind of feel like I want to do this after it's fucked me twice. Normally I wouldn't consider doing this, but since the game's crashed on me twice, resulting in me having a much more negative scenario, I am legit going to do this. And I think at one point they did it to me, so I, at this point it's like fair's fair. Again, I'm doing this primarily because the game's crashed on me twice. Um, because of this particular settlement. So I think if we just bar if we just borrow the settlement, there's no guarantee it wins. And we got it. Oh no, it was the army inside. Um You know, I'll call that a win. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, you know what? This is this is a good thing. I like this. This is okay. Army inside is very small. It is on it is tis but a fort. Um but yeah, okay. No, I feel better about this. Not like 100% happy, but better. Right. Anyway. I think well, that's probably going to have to be it, isn't it? Yeah, more or less. Alright, well, um, that's pretty much indeed. Right, actually, we have one more do turn to go for, so should I... Who's in this army? Um, not a lot of good shit. You're what's left of that army, so I suppose I should just try and... I just tried to bribe the settlement. Nah, he's gonna... Yeah, he's not gonna make that one. I could try and bribe him, but nah. Um... I mean, that army is fairly significant. And if I got rid of it... Yeah, let's fuck it. Let's go for it. Let's give this my... Let's give this guy. Okabayashi. Oh, he took... He took the money. He took the money. And it, he's now mine. As a... Right, so we're going to delete everything in this army, except the samurai. And then, yeah, if those guys get attacked, those guys get attacked. But it's them versus an entire fucking garrison. Oh, speaking of which, uh, you're dead. You are dead, dead. You died to some goddamn infantry. Okay. I mean, to be fair, it's what should happen because, you know, cavalry is not always superior, but I let my infantry bias uh, fall, away to the, fall to the wayside sometimes. Concealed army discovered. Ah, that's the army that we just killed. Okay. Um, right, I have a decent shinobi. I also potentially... No, I don't. I really don't, but we're going to nudge this guy up. Okay, so Sagami is going to be one of the more crucial provinces to grab now, which is fine because it is quite an important province. Um, okay, there. That's probably going to be where we wrap up for today. So thank you all very much. Um, sorry for the weird disjointed nature of this particular episode. Um, hopefully by the time this comes out, enough good shit will have happened post this episode. But yeah, so anyway, I'll catch up with you in the next one. This is Mr. Yeager signing up. Have a good one.